Hello, my name is Prime, and welcome back to this episode of Prime News, and recently, SES Software published another blog post on the West Balkan DLC for Euro Truck Simulator 2, this time talking about the various landmarks that we can find across the upcoming DLC. As per usual, I will have the blog post link down in the description below. That's where I'm getting the 13 brand new screenshots and the information I'll be sharing. Given the current standard for SES Software DLCs, us ETS2 players can expect a multitude of landmarks, as they really do make the DLC more realistic. Some of these landmarks are large, some of them may be small, but they all serve a very important role in that region's history and identity. Although there are a number of landmarks that will be found across the West Balkans region, some of these landmarks can be kind of categorized into these few areas. Those areas are stadiums, cathedrals, educational centers, which include museums and libraries, and then of course your other art slash statue architecture that can be found as more of a monument sense. The provided screenshots actually do a very nice job at showing the diverse nature of these landmarks. If you features a few cathedrals, of course some statues, and some very interesting castles I will call them, or fortresses that are located on some hillsides. If you want to know some of the names of these particular landmarks and some of the extra details revolving around them, I would highly recommend going over and checking out the blog post itself. As I'm going to be honest, I don't want to butcher the names of these various landmarks, and if I were to attempt to say some of them, I know it is not going to end well. But nonetheless, these landmarks look truly incredible, and I cannot wait to explore these various West Balkan regions regions for myself. Comment down below what you think about these landmarks, what landmarks do you think should be added to the DLC, if not already included within this blog post, and what region are you looking forward to most within the West Balkans. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.